I'm definitely making a forge here, by the way. Once we once we get the spire established. Oh, no kidding. Loading screen tip. Arid land does not have a very impressive um, spell effect, but that's perfectly fine, really. It doesn't sound like it would. If it was like burning land, then I'd expect something pretty awesome. Twisting flames does look cool, though. Ah! Wasting no time whatsoever, then. Haste me, I will haste. Probably, maybe Barrack? Let's try Barrack this time. Sorry, I can't. Alright, let's do it. Shield on me. And then everyone else. Let's do it. On it. On it. Yeah, I don't even care about getting the first strike in right now. Um with Ebb, I'm not really I feel like I could actually just go ahead and use um what's it called? Light of the Grave. I could use Hard the Storm too. I've never tried this. There's a decent amount here, so let's go with Hard the Storm, I guess. Let's see how awesome this looks. Okay, that looks cool. I love how this person's just like, oh, I don't know, I don't want to really be involved in that. Oh my god. What? That is cool. Light this person on fire. I should be able to annihilate this person with two strikes. Oh my god, that's awesome! Are you kidding me? Wow. I am way into that. How long does this last? Because this basically decided the fight. It's still on. I guess I could check, huh? Uh, 45 seconds. That's pretty huge. It's a really long casting time, but that could be alleviated very easily with haste. So, uh, yeah, I would assume if I want something really dead, then I would just, this seems like an upgrade to me. Plus two armor. Eb, put that on, please. No, equip it. Okay, now you look just like, um, Siren. Oh. Okay, well, I didn't expect this. Octave, cool. Nice, you're named after music terms. I, I hope there's cres uh, crescendo somewhere. Oh, you're talking to me? Okay. What in the name of Kairos are you plotting, boss? Why'd you kill this choirman up ahead? He points his weapon at you, face flushed scarlet. Don't try to deny it. My gal, Pastol... Pastol? Pastol, whatever. Pastol saw it all. Um, hmm. Well, I suggest you just run. Frigging piss! It's the rogue fate binder! <laughs> okay. With a yelp, the uh, Octave fum uh, fumbles to draw his blade, tripping over backwards over, uh, over a loose stone. Furies to arms! At arms! Shit, shit, damn! Help! That was a sorry display. We should put this terrified rodent out of its misery. Barrack draws his weapon and readies for combat. You're way into this, huh, Barrack? This is a fight, it looks like. What is Scarlet's skin, first of all? 
It's not Scarlet Skin. I don't know what that is. Um, where would favor abilities be? Not here, not there, not there. Oh, is this, this is probably, whatever, I can look later. I'm pretty sure this is just a passive, though. Well, whatever. Uh, we have a lot of, we have a lot of options to do now, though. Let's just, let's start with haste on her, Siren. She could haste me in return. Or not. For six seconds. It seems like fast mode's on, but it's not. Did I get interrupted? Or does Siren have haste on? She does. Okay, I thought I got, inter I got interrupted. Never mind. Did six seconds pass? It now it did, yes. Okay, sweet. Haste me, Siren. Or it did not. No, wait, don't haste yourself. Stop it, stop it. Haste me. Now, everyone's lined up in a really, really nice line for this. That, the other person's just out of range. That's fine. We could hit three. That's good enough. There's a total of six here? There is. Okay. Well, Horde, you're about to die. Disengage. Ha ha ha. Okay, Ab. Uh... I, let's say potion. I swear, they, the Scarlet Core seems to have something that actually re uh, prevents healing from happening. Which is not good in this case. Um, healing Wisp could help a little bit, I guess. Assuming you get it off in time. I think it's time to knock back. Okay, that should delay for a little bit. Okay, get Ab's now in a decent position here. Uh, let's follow this up with Grave Light. Maybe? Where's Grave Light? Light of the Grave, rather. Are you, are you binded or what? What are you doing? Just go and attack then. Oh, he's, he's casting, um, Clash of Iron. Okay, that makes more sense. That makes more sense. Okay, time to, time for you to die. Will do. Strike and then get back. Did you? I spotted death. Okay, I see it now. Uh, go ahead and disarm that. We'll go loot. There's nothing too interesting here. Staggering burn. I really should be using consumables more often, just to do them. But um, it's not really needed. Oh my God! What happened here? Man, they use these poisons like crazy. I guess I shouldn't be too surprised, but hey. Oh my goodness, okay. Well, let's just get right into it then. One caster, that should be fine. Barrick, how long does, does Vital Body last? 45 seconds. Um... We'll, we'll not use that just yet. Once per rest. Ooh, blade. That could be cool. Iron Storm also could be kind of cool. Oh, man. We're fighting close quarters here. But that should be okay, actually. It might work in our favor. Except I have none of my AoE abilities up just yet. Except for... Well, Arid lands, actually. Let's, let's do this. Ooh, 
Ooh, yeah. I love how debuffs can critically hit. It's pretty cool. Out of there, freaking the hell out. Because, like, everything's just so... Tight quarters here. Let's fireball the ones in the back. And I can now twist and flame them, too. This should do it, I think. Or maybe a little mess. I hope it won't, but we'll see. Yep. Got it. I barely need to pause this, honestly. Horde bracers. Nothing interesting here. Again, not that interesting. Okay, what's going on here? Extract the crystals. And that did what? Oh, hello. Well, if this is just going to be unreachable areas that have, like, just a little bit of loot, then we might as well just go back and climb the, the rope that we just passed by earlier. Which would be right here. Man, another Scarlet Chorus gang wiped out just like that, huh? Who is this? Why were you even up here? Zeal. That sounds... Oh, it's a dagger? Forget that. Oh, lame. Yeah, forget that. Sorry, I can't. There is a path over here that I think we Sorry, did not explore, or maybe it's just a dead end, because we're really close to the um. Yeah, it's it's just this. What am I extracting the crystals for? Eruptions of crystal like this one appeared in the Stone Sea shortly after Kyrosidix tore the land asunder. It isn't known if they are a byproduct of the Overlord's magic or the result of Karen's experiments during the war. Uh, probably Karen's exper uh, experiments, I would say. Sorry, I can't. The edicts kind of don't do anything unnatural other, th other than just stir can't up natural elements. Unnaturally. But it does, it's it's not like crazy time magic or anything. That's what the um That's what the people that oppose Kairos tend to do, actually. Okay. See that these are your traps? I'm sure they are. That? Yeah, I see it. And we're gonna disarm it right in front of them. Uh, buildings like buildings like this one once numbered in the thousands of in Azure's great cities. Those that weren't swallowed by the earth have been left in in ghost towns, haunting remainders uh, reminders of a more glorious past. What's up? How do we get over there? I wonder. Is there a path over there? Oh, okay. There, there was stairs down. Ooh, I missed some stuff a then. Here. A lot of stuff. Hello, sigil of illusion, lame. We could just rest right now. That's an option. Yes. But, but we don't really need to. What's this? Say, uh, sage's journal entry. Day 36. My journey to Dawning Spire at the Howling Rock continues. Unfortunately, the route indicated on the map I acquired leads straight into the Den of the Beast. Surely I could find a way past them, around them. If they are the last obstacle between myself and the Spire, also, I could do... I could allow nothing to deter me. Also? Okay. Uh, let's move the boulder, because our athletics is awesome. What did that even do? 
Oh, that drained this area, so now we could find like this dead beast Can't person. Do that. Okay. You use a bow. Civilized. It's good to be civil. Um, Vagrant's Claw, Chalcedony. Hello. Spotted something. Saren, go ahead and disarm that, please. And now we will just explore more stuff. Another charcoal rubbing. Yeah, I know how this works. Thank you. At this point, we definitely know how this works. And this is more more crystals. Apparently, ups, collecting crystals apparently ups your athletics. But I guess it would be related to mining. Why not? Can't do Why that. not? Can't do that. Probably because we have to cross a rope. But yeah, let's go talk with the beast people. I'm sure they love us now. And we can learn more about them. I am not opposed to attacking the beast people either if they prove to be... Uh, not useful. Or n maybe not useful is a bit too strong of a sentence. Um, or misleading, rather. If they if they turn out to be evil, let's say. We'll see. So far, they seem okay. Do not move, human. She sniffs uh, suspiciously at the air. Explain or die. What does human come seeking from Stonestalker Den? Um... I need to speak with the leader of your tribe. Yeah, that's pretty much why I'm here, so yep, that's what I need to do. The guard nods her head once, sharply decision made. Come, enter, but do not seek to cause strife. Prima Hundred Blood will speak with, will want to speak with sm a strange smelling human. Well, the last time we did this, we just outright killed the leader, apparently. Beastman has, beast woman has sharp eyes, is watching human. You have a pretty nice place going on here, I will admit. Hey, Black Ma, hi, and speaks for soil. Uh-huh. All right. Leveling, oh my god, leveling up by jumping, it's like Morrowind. Why did I do this? God, not to go around, ugh. That was stupid of me. I should have realized there was no point in doing that and have to go all the way around again. Thank goodness for fast mode. Also, we leveled up, so... What do we do for me? Massive blow... Two-handed mastery could be fun. Stance is pointless, because I'm pretty sure we only have one stance active at a time, right? If we can't, then that's crazy, and that completely defeats what I know of stances in games. Two-handed mastery might be the winner here. Cleave... Could be kind of interesting, too, actually. You know why? Because we already do so much AoE damage in our little combo thing. Um, but, prim but the primary combo... I mean, the primary reason to do the combo is not for AoE damage. It's just to, it's to burst someone down single-targetly. Uh, so to that end... Two-handed weapon mastery, I think, is the winner here. Which means we're pretty much committing to two-handed weapons, but that's okay at this point. Beast woman. Hello, beast woman. Okay, beast woman. And yes, I save like crazy because that's in case of a crash. Stone Warden, is that a name? 
Or is it a title? Riff dig. Don't like humans in tribe lands. Stink of sweat and filth. Look like I look like ironclads, but are weak. Kill for own kind for food on barren paths. Uh, okay. Let's see. What would ironclad disfavored slaughter? I mean, why would ironclad disfavored slaughter innocent travelers on the roadways? Roadways, rather. He cocks his head to one side, thinking, How should Beastman know thoughts of humans? Beastman, rather. Uh, saw with sharp Beastman eyes, ironclad swarm scavengers at place with Greystone. Remember, because Hunt was strange, ironclad smelled of rot and were weak, struggled to kill pack that was same size. That does sound strange. I'll look into it. Hunt and stealth. Ironclads are dangerous when encountered, usually. Can I yap now? Have to dig deeper hole before sun sleeps. What are you digging? Beast woman mystic. On it. Hello, Stone Warden. Why has human come to Stonestalker den to make trouble? Fight with Beast Woman? If so, Beast Woman will happily rip claws through human's chest. Okay, well. Um. I've been sent to find a group of missing settlers. I believe they are these captives. A, th a thick fingered, gnarled, uh, gnarled hand scrapes. A <laughs> scrapes along a prominent jaw as the beast woman considers your words briefly makes no difference to tribe well it makes a difference to me I wish to free these captives beast, uh, beast woman whole body quivering the beast woman doubles over clutching her tawny mis uh, midsection as she hacks and cackles hysterically the inhuman laugh tears the heavens ear splittingly shrill and prolonged free weak sniveling humans be punished by prima no beast woman thinks not Uh, I saved Leftclaw from Halfgate, so the Stone Stalkers owe me. Now, free these settlers. Leftclaw has returned to tribe. Human speaks true. The, the Beast Woman nods and scratches at her chin. Tribe will return favor. We'll release humans. Good. I'll see. I'll see that the settlers make it to safety. Be warned. Next time, next when human trespasses in Stone Stalker lands, Beast Woman will not capture them. We'll hunt humans to death instead. Okay. Well, that was easy. This recessed space appears to have been a nesting area where beast men young are often confined for safety. It, it, it has most been used... Ah, it has most recently been used to hold captured outsiders. Hi, how you guys doing? Fate Binder, Fate Binder, please! These beasts took us from the plains. They're holding us against our wills. It's only a matter of time until they kill and eat us. Please, you're here to help us, aren't you? Uh, yeah, they agreed. Um, you're, you're free to go. Archons be praised. Thank you. And thank you a thousand times more, Fate Finder. We won't forget what you've done for us. See you guys later. Well, I'm sure they'll make it. Hopefully. Okay, Black Ma, who are you? Human. The creature wrinkles her broad, gray nose in disgust. Speak or leave, beast woman be. Uh, what's with the whelps? Our Black Ma's, the beast woman growls, her dark tone a mixture of both warning and pride, are strong. Good whelps, smart club, smart Smart cubs have grown big, but are only but are only two seasons old. It's early for whelps to leave brood hole and room loosed, but Prima needed den to cage humans who hunted elder teeth. Um, what's elder teeth? Elder teeth are pride of stone stalker mystics, are precious plum crystals that sprout in stone lands. When harvested, elder mystics wear shards like necklace of teeth to increase strength of bite and strike. Why do the stone stalkers care about these elder teeth? 
elder teeth are strength of stone stalkers. Humans invaded territory, claimed to hunt rocks called Azurlith. Azurlith, rather, but were spotted stealing elder teeth. Now lying humans must suffer. Uh, well, I want to ask you about something else. Human stench makes beast woman itch. Yep, yep, quickly or scamper free. Or scamper fleet, rather. How did you get here? Human mewlings make no sense. Come to live? Have always lived. Stone lands once belong, have belonged to beast woman from ancient seasons. Even when beast women were blunt clawed, no fanged, hairless like human. Okay. Azure lands belong to stone stalkers, and stone stalkers belong to hundred blood. Has led, tri has led tribe through many seasons. Many, many seasons. Since beast woman tore out throat and ate hard to last pri prima. Okay. The beast woman uh, swells with pride. She rubs at the center of her chest with gnarled, curled underfingers. How old is Hundred Blood? More than five, more than uh, more than five, many times again. Mystics count. Have to create many and hundred seasons of blood. Okay, I'm not gonna say the other one that I just saw there because that seems bad. If I challenge and defeat Hundred Blood, do I become the Prima? As you approach, a hunched elderly beast woman dugs furatively at the ground. She startles at the sound of your footfall and rears up, clutching a gleaming shard of azurelith to her chest. Leave Mystic be. Speak for soil. Communes only with stone stalkers and tribe lands. And human is neither tribe mate nor rock. Well, I, I think I'm glad I'm not a rock. At least that would be interesting if I was. Do you have eyes on? On this? Actually, no, I don't. Blunt claws will not. Blunt claws will not enter Howling Rock. No to hairless. No to humans. Okay, guess I won't be going that way then. What were you talking about, Bear? I will find this. Do I have eyes on what? Oh, hello. It's, it's Chalcedony. Okay. I mean, I like Chel, I like gems. So not gonna argue whatsoever. So how do we get to 100 blood exactly? Are you up here, maybe? You have to be. You gotta be. 100 blood, alright. Hello, 100 blood. First, I will loot your box. And then loot everything in this crate. Wow, you were keeping a lot of stones here. Thank you, by the yeah. way. So, how do you do? Human. <laughs> the leader of the Stone Stalker tribe furls her brow at your approach. Feral amber eyes tracking your every step. Who approaches Hundred Blood, strongest in all stone lands? First free prowler, beast woman who reaches without bonds, mystic and prima to Stone Stalker tribe. She sniffs deeply, nostrils flared as she parses your scent. Hmm. Human smells like Will of Alpha, like snarling over fresh kill. Unusual, but still unwelcome. Why is strange, strong, stinking human crept into the tribe's den? Bray now for hundred blood, prima of great stone stalkers. Hurry, human, or beast woman will grow bored and chase like bleeding prey. Um, for a while the tribe followed Cairn, Archon of Stone, correct? Beast woman takes strength from land's pulse, from sky's reach, from ocean's swell, or treats or trees' roots. Stone stalkers were mired like fertile, or, or stone stalkers were, mi were mired like fertile muck of farm fields. But great mystic called Cairn toughened both land and skin of beast woman. Draw tribe together to break yokes of human slavers. Even now, as stone Cairn dreams and growls in sleep, tribe grows stronger. Tribe owes mystic from northern mountains many and much gratitude. Without Cairn, hundred blood could not have left stone stalker. Could not have led stone stalkers to freedom. Uh, there's a spire here. How do I get to it? 
Human speaks of horizon rock do called Dawning Spire, Howling Rock, yes. Pines for that which towered deep over the mountain's peaks. She glances in the direction of the, dis of the, dis of the distant spire, huffs and scratches one teat. Human could cross through Stone Den to reach Mystic Spire, but why would Hundred Blood, great prima to stone stalkers, let humans stalk freely through, to, through, uh, through tribe's territory? No, if human wants to favor some tribe, human must, human must first earn Hundred Blood's respect, earn Trinket's shield, and then prima will permit human to tri uh, trisp onto Howling Rock, uh, Howling Rock, rather. Oh, what shield? She snorts, amused. As if human doesn't know. Yes, Hundred Blood speaks of shield that belong to humans, called Tearsman, toughest, pr uh, toughest protector in all of Stone Lands. It is Mystic Shield that Korra's pests have sniffed and sniffed and dug carelessly for, but cannot find. She licks her fangs, feeling particularly self-pleased, because shield belongs now to great stone stalkers. Uh, I I want to learn more about the stone stalker tribe. Beast women are the oldest species, and the stone stalkers are the, are the biggest ranking of beast women. She flashes her she flashes her teeth with pride. Beast woman's blood runs back to the days of dust, to time before azure rose in the stone lands, to time before old walls. She snuffs. Time before humans ruined lands with territorials where territory spats in war for dominance. What are elder teeth? Elder teeth of the strength of stone stalkers are rocks that gleam and glow from earth blood of ancestors, our legacy from first tribe who were born from azure lands. She taps a necklace of purple crystals worn on, in, on a fray leather thr uh, thong or about her muscled neck. Stone stalkers use elder teeth to make mystic claws strike harder and mystic bites to cut deeper. What's your role here? She regards you with, with a deadly seriousness. Hundred Blood is Prima, leader to many alphas and to packs which form the whole of the tribe. Prima protects and preserves tribe's way of life. Any who disagree may challenge Prima's red rule in, bl in a blood in blood match. Rather, she sneers, unconcerned at the thought. Hundred Blood, strongest in all Stone Lands, has killed many to protect tribe and will kill many more before own body dies. Where were you during the conquest? Where, if not near Stone Den, can human not see? She flicks her claws, agitated. Beast Woman fought to protect stone stalkers, where Kairos' edict ravaged stone lands, wrestled final freedom of tribe, reclaimed territories while Pete grouped yowled, spit, split rather, swallowed mystic called Cairn. Stone stalkers watched Kairos' raise, Kairos raise human's den called Plains Gate. Den groaned and wreathed and drowned whines of fleeing and dying humans. Hundred Blood spreads her fangs in a satisfied grin. Ground still trembles even here, but Hundred Blood cares not. Even when the land rages, beast women will, th will thrive. Stone stalkers can steal from land, unlike weak, muling humans. S shifting stone does not hinder tribe. Wait, what? I don't recall this happening at all. Uh, Kairos casted the Edict of Stone in order to destroy the traitors Archon Karn. Um, Karen or whatever. The resulting, the resulting quakes changed the landscapes of Azure from verdant plains to a treacherous wasteland of shifting rocks. You, it says you, allowed Karen to reach the city of Plainsgate before casting the Edict. In his death throes, Karen devastated much of the city as the earth swallowed him whole. I believe it's Kaleo who actually did this, not me. But okay. Why am I not surprised to see a beast celebrate something so horrific? I have no love for the people of the tears, but not even I would revel in the destruction. All you care about is violence and blood. You better hope that's not how this ends. Uh, what are your traditions? Stone stalker ancestors were born in first of seasons, were weak and blunt, clawed when young but grew tougher tougher with land beca became strong beast woman of this day ancestors always have led path forward the massive beast nods her head in reverence mystics remember and honor ancestors in breath of rights just once i would like to be i would like to meet a beast man who claims not to have come from the most ancient of tribes but like a choirman boasting about having a small dirk doubt such a thing exists rights what's your what sort of rights have many rights. Have many rights to harvest elder teeth. 
rides to become better mystic or to grow from weak whelp from weak whelp into strong into strong stone stalker tribe mate have rights to honor hunting to take through dominance or to, or, or to even rule tribe for many years humans uh, for many years human humans forbid tribe sacred rights but now stone stalkers prowl free will honor ancestors and grow stronger and stronger still will not be slaved again will not be enslaved again uh I don't I'm gonna I'm not gonna ask what elder teeth are again I don't know why that's lit up I'm looking for the Azure shield and was told you know where it is tribe has shield yes it is proof of hundred blood's prowess could trade shield to human could trade shield to human she scratches the side of her head with that one long curved claw but why should beast woman want to Um, what do you want? Ex what do you want in exchange for the shield? Disfavored predators, hunters, and enslavers of whole beast women and tribes have slunk and burrowed in the, into rocks at Jagged Maw. In short seasons, we'll be scratching at tribe's den. We'll be threat to we'll be threat to cubs and elders. She crooks two dark, uh, wickedly dark curved claws at you in both accusa accusation and violent demand. Prima will trade shield to human if human agrees to hunt and slaughter ironclads in beast woman lands. Okay, I'm way into that. That's okay. Sure. Fine, let's do it. Good, human. Kill disfavored for tribe. Then can slink to sp uh, shire to spine to spire shire what can then can slink to spire shine and in, in gulf glow and beg red fang for shield okay all right well that's interesting cool i mean it's better than just wiping everybody out we're gonna have to wipe people out anyways, but just not these people. Time to go through the disfavored again. And have to do a lot of backtracking apparently. Is this the entire area that we are currently, I guess it is, wow. These areas seem so small, but there's a lot of things to do in them. Primarily in the, way, in the form of story, but still. I thought that said stand down gorge for a second. Okay, we have some stuff to do. Aurora Spire. I'm guessing if we go there right now, that would cause issues. So I won't. And we're just going to do this the diplomatic way. This probably just means kill everybody in these two areas, right? So, I say we take a bit of a break, and then we kill everybody afterwards, because we've been pretty much killing everybody for a while now. Um, oh, you're hostile, huh, Cadis? In that case, how about we just begin, and then we'll take a break. <laughs> All right. Cadis, I'm sorry, but you know what's about to happen to you. So, get ready for it. Because it's going to be very quick. Alright, let's begin. Cadis, you seem to be actually an iron guard, huh? Whatever. And you do have... Do you have Graven Ashes Aegis? No. Okay, well. You're retreating, really? <laughs> well, I assume these people can actually fight, unlike the Scarlet Chorus. Will do. Sad 
bad day for you, huh? I, I that attack be quiet. Doesn't work. matter. Just keep on attacking. Because worse comes to worse, and I can just attack. Ashes E just must be up. Yep, it's up now. Okay. Well, he knows we're here now. I could use um, my blast here. I don't see much of a point in doing that, though. So I'd say we just stab him to death. Stab this one to death, too. I think I could use Twisting Flames effectively now and hit at least. That's not Twisting Flames, but okay. At least two. So I shall. Well, this weapon is like nipple on it. Both dead. Hi, hi, hi. Ooh. Oh my god. That was annihilation right there. Complete annihilation. I don't even need Barrett to actually come here, so let's just burn him up, and then thrust. Goodbye. Oh. oh, Oathbound, okay. I think that's the first Oathbound we actually killed. Okay. Is this actually good armor? It's, it'll improve my recovery speed, but it'll also make me weaker to fire. That's not so bad. Crush, on the other hand, could be bad if we're fighting someone that actually uses crush damage, which would, I believe that would actually be kind of bad against the, um, the disfavored, because I think I got Earth it. Shatterers, I mean, Earth Shakers do crushing damage. Well, okay. Oh. One more left. Oh, two more left. Okay. Stone shoot. No, wait. I'm over here. Well, let's just annihilate this person then. To myself. It's probably gonna be a real annihilation here. Sunder, double strike, bam, and bam. Jeez. <laughs> they don't survive that combo at all. I love it. That attack didn't work. And now we'll use a fireball in a single person because, you know what, why not? I guess if I want to improve my control fire hey. skill, I might as well... I'm sorry, is everyone dead? Okay, that's fast. I'm carrying too much. Okay, what is this? Well... I'm still going to take a break, but, um... Yep, everyone's dead. Okay, we don't learn the uh, spell right now, but we did instead get plus five to control stone. So that's experience, and I love it. The stone sea, uh, st the stone sea environment is harsh and unforgiving. Arid, arid plant life is all about is about all that can survive in these parts. Is this seriously everything? Oh, that was cake. No talking, no anything. All right. Aged planks of wood are, and withered rope are the only things keeping travelers from uh, tra travelers alive while crossing the great chasms of the Stone Sea. Well. Okay. Um. Yeah, let's just take a break then. I guess we'll move on to the next area, kill everyone there too, and. We'll see where that puts us at, but we should be able to access the spire soon. And I'm really interested in that because that'll let me finally get a forge up. But um, yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later.